Somehow, the heroes had beached the big blooper and crossed the tile pool. But before they could dry, they saw the imposing silhouette of Fort Francis. It sure is getting dark, Peach said in a quiet voice. But when they looked up, they realized they were in the shadow of a huge tree. Mario, knowing in his gut this must be the way, set out towards the great tree. No, it is not the great tree, but it is chapter 3-3! Three, three. Up, up, and a tree. It is not the great tree from Boggly Woods. We are instead at the Dotwood tree. Alright, so this is a interesting area to say the least. That's another, there's another tiny shop there we can't go into right now. Uh, I'm not doing so good in terms of items. I wouldn't want to heal up. I'm going to use my shroom shape. Alright, so this level is a bit frustrating to say the least. Uh, uh, it's a verti- it's verti- we're going up vertically. So, um, what can happen is, is if you fall, you'll have to backtrack where you were before. Oh, we got a poison turbo. Hurry up, I want to hit you. Alright, well. Alright, so. Oh, yeah, that didn't really do much for me there. Uh, basically, that sign is there to tell you to go up, stupid. It's basically a sign saying, go up, stupid. All right, now what we're gonna want to do is oh, uh, oh no, no, oh, no, no! Okay, that wasn't that bad. Whoa, whoa! whoa. Goodbye, Koopa. All right, ground pound this. Oh, what? A, what a graceful jump that she, the princess, could do. I have to say, Peach is honestly really badass in this game. Like, she could, like, throw down when she needs to. Alright, uh, let's go this way, I think. So, that is a good move. So, yeah. Alright, oh. Alright, yeah, dried shroom, not really worth going after. And now, this doorway is covered in dried bark, so we can't go in there. Thankfully, Bowser can light it on fire, which for some reason here only selectively burns off the part that is covering the door. I do not know why the whole tree does not catch on fire. Like, it just stops. Like, if anything, the whole tree... You know, if anything, it'll be a hell of a lot easier just to burn down the tree and just walk around it, but... Oh, wait, hang on. There's actually some other stuff here that I didn't show. There's other, some other secrets. I'm gonna go back down. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Well, that is the pipe up there that we want to go into. I have to backtrack a little bit. Ah. Ah. Let's go in that pipe. Okay, now in here, a few coins, that's not bad, but if you go in here, there's a lot of coins. You want to grab those, okay, I guess it wasn't really worth, actually, no. it wasn't really worth going out of my way for that, but it's something, I guess. Alright, let's go in this way. Go up of this away. Oh, guess what? You heard that sound. It knows it's exactly what you think it is. All right, now here we got a little bit of a puzzle. 
So we have to um so the so you may have noticed different uh blue and um uh pink uh, blue platforms. We just hit that switch and that just made it uh pink platforms appear. So now this the rest of the so here we got some crazy daisies returning enemies from the first two games. Uh, if they hit you with that their attack, you will um. Oh, what was I gonna say? You will um fall asleep and be helpless for a few seconds until you shake to wake back up. So that's not good. Nope, won't work. Come on, go back up and that. Alright. Right. Ah! Alright, let's switch back to Thudley. And that will open up a ladder, which will basically be a shortcut. Once we do that, we're gonna want to hit this. Go up here. Right. Oh. Okay, go over this way. Now if you flip, I think there's something over here. Yep, there is some there is a pipe here. I'm gonna go in the pipe. Freaking Mario. Alright, so we got some spikes here. Can't flip to avoid them, thankfully. We got a friend here. Ah. Or not. Not doing too hot here. Okay. I guess we're gonna have to hit this. Alright, well, I guess if we get hit by the spikes. Oh. oh man, you have to start over from there. Peach is good to use there because her her uh, parasol will make her invincible. I'm just gonna th put this bomb here. You can blow it up at any time. And I'm gonna flip over here. Oh, there's a switch. <coughs> bomb the oh, bomb the switch again. So here's what you gotta do. What you need to do here, put the bomb there. Jump over here. Bomb it again. And now we have where we need to go. We just have to get on top here. Alright. Now we could go and I'm just gonna wait for it to loop around again. I don't wanna take my chances again doing that. Let's go into this pipe. Alright, we got some chain chomps here. Can't, okay, we cannot grab them with Thoreau, so let's use Thudley. Ah, destroyed. So yeah, Bowser with Thudley is a killing machine. A uh, Peach 2 card, which, uh, where is Peach 1, you may ask? Well, we'll find, well, that's something for later, but Peach 2 is, oh. Hang on, where is it? Yep, even, yes, yeah, so Peach 2. Peach is looking fabulous with her marriage. Mar Alright, yep, this is Peach in her wedding dress. Little, little did she know that she would end up trying to come to get married to Bowser again. And try to. Alright. Alright, let's, um. Ah! No, 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 no! Okay, good. At least, I, okay, that wasn't too bad. Let's go this way and head where we need to go. Alright, go in 
here. Okay. Now here, this is a bit of an interesting puzzle what you gotta do here. Oh, that guy's just freaking out over there. Hang on, I wanna try something here. So normally what you're supposed to use is use slim and wait and um, go in there, but um, alternatively you can just crouch in and just do what I just did there. Alright, let's just uh, go back through. Okay. Now that we have that. go now is the question. We gotta get up there. Flip. And then, uh oh. Hit the switch. And that'll open the door. Oh. Now how do we get what's in here? Let's try ground pounding it. Alright, mushroom. Now we can fall, 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 fall. So those are Tyloid enemies. Um, there are a whole bunch of them with different colors. And um, they all have different things and different attributes, which is kind of cool, actually. Oh. Let's go up here. Okay, let's save the game, because I have a feeling we're going to come up to a tough part. And, oh, no. With the Bowser. I love playing as Bowser. Bowser's awesome. Ha ha ha! Finally, you arrive! You don't wear tardiness well. Who are you supposed to be, Mr. Frilly Pants? You get a tiny balloon animal? You must be Bowser. I knew the moment I saw the flailing nubbins you call arms. <laughs> Even ba Dementio knows. He's in on it. I am a humble servant of Count Black. Master of Dimensions, Blizzard of Crowds, I am Dementio. Dementio. Dementi who? It is truly enchanting to finally meet my hapless victims. I have prepared a special morsel of a treat for you. Uh oh. How about some magic? And voila! You are now in Dimension D, a dimension of my own creation. In this mind bending realm, my attacks are 256 times more potent. I am now far more powerful. I can blur you with the raise of an eyebrow. Now we must duel like two gleaming banjos on a moonlit stoop. Alright, Dementio here. Oh. Can you pierce this illusion? Alright, so he's got all sorts he can duplicate himself like that. Oh, there we go. I think he has like 30 HP as far- uh oh. You don't want to get trapped in there, otherwise he's gonna blow you up. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh. Weird, that didn't work. That's strange. There we go. You can do a lot of damage but with Dudley. Bam! That did him in. Blows of the miniature jackhammers wielded by tiny, angry road workers. How is this possible? This dimension makes me 256 times too powerful. Wahaha, <laughs> you're such an idiot! This place makes me stronger too! <laughs> of course, this was simply an amusement that played exactly as I planned. Were you amused? That was just an hors d'oeuvre! The next time we meet, you will feast on a deadly eight course meal. And with that, my diminutive limbed foe, I must say. Ciao! Hmm. Dementio? Give me a break! That's the lamest villain ever! Hmm, a little more perhaps. 
They are strong, but they must be stronger yet to defeat Black. I must make sure they can face him when the time comes around at last. Mm -hmm. All right. Um. Oh. Uh oh. Ah. 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 Hang on. Wait. I'm just gonna pause the game because I want to get a drink. All right. So we're coming up on it now. That's a spiny there. Um. And you know what that means. Where there are spinies, there are lakitus. Ah. Okay, that is annoying. Okay. You can't even see them, and they're just getting in the way. Alright, good. Right, we're gonna want to... Alright, it's probably a good idea to actually have Peach, because then you could, um... Do that. So, as we were told by Barry, oh, there's red gusts of wind. We want to jump on one. And we want to get in that pipe. They also take you back, too, interestingly enough. All right, perfect. And with that, we're coming close to the end. You come over here. There's a block you can hit that gives you coins. All right, perfect. And now with that, end of chapter. and Bowser had scaled the tree and defeated Dementio. The exhausted heroes were revealed to, were relieved to finally see the ivory towers of Fort Francis. Was Tippy safe? Was the next pure heart really waiting for them ahead? Their only answers were the strange voices carried on from the wind inside the fort. Chapter 3-4 The Battle of Fort Francis. Oh boy. So this is where that dweeb Francis lives. Ooh, what? <laughs> What's this castle got over mine? Do you think Tippy is all right? I'm starting to worry. Oh, what's the worst that can happen? Uh-oh. <laughs> this is so high technical. It's a totally undiscovered digital species. No, I must document it. Mario. Ugh. Yes, shake that thorax. Ugh. The digibotter.nerve forum guys will be so jealous when I post these shots online. Well, that's just freaky. No entry unless you're a super genius like me or a totally hot babe. Stay out. Well, uh, well, we have to get in there. The door is locked, so... Thankfully, there is another way in. We will need to use Thoreau. Hit that block. And in there... We get a key! And now with that... Not so much of a secure castle now. I say Mario is pretty smart. Now this castle, if you know where to go, is actually very easy. However, for the sake of because I like this area a lot and I would like to show everything, I want to I'm going to go through the whole thing. All right, let's see here. Welcome home, master. Today is the street day for Prince of the Unicorns. Ma de de do not forget. Okay. Welcome home, Master. A baseball game in extra innings has delayed the start of Starship x Not. I adjusted the recording now to start by 30 minutes to compensate. Welcome home, Master. I have finished removing the commercial breaks we recorded programs. Welcome home, Master. The new space combat sim Star Starship x Not Space Bloops has arrived by mail. Man, this guy is a nerd. <sighs> 
High tech the cow. Sweet. The resolution on these images is just breathtaking. Nerr. Welcome home, master. I have finished removing Oh, we already got that. We already just said that. Alright. So, uh, we're gonna go in this way. Alright, let's see what this guy has to say. I have cataloged all of Master's comics and filed them away. Do not think I did it out of the kindness of my robo heart. They were beginning to clog vital fire escape routes of the castle. Alright, so if you flip this way, you can, um... We're gonna go in here. Now we have this guy here. Um... Oh, wait, no. So normally it is not... It, uh... You can't, if you jump on it, it won't do anything, but if you, um... Ah. Ah. Well... You can, uh, put that thing in there, in that thing, and it'll blow up. Alright. Just, uh, do a thing. So, these guys here police the halls. So, we got these doors here. Quiet in the hallway. Stomping deserves master's nap time. come over here you'll notice that the so yeah it says stomping deserves the master's nap time so um let's uh stomp on the ground we go in here oh well we can't go in there yet there's a lot of spikes and unfortunately we'll have to move in order to be able to get past that so we'll have to come back here later so let's go in this door Alright, we got another, um, puzzle here to do. Alright, let's just teach. Avoid that guy. Okay. Now here... Probably wondering what you gotta do. This is a uh, this guy here is flying, and will you'll have to knock him into that, which will cause a bridge to open. Well, you're critical. Use a shroom shaker or other item to remember and restore your HP. Or if you always go back to flip side, we're using the return pipe. All right, yes. So, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, no, no, no. That was close. Uh, I got this. Oh, fried egg. Let's eat that. Good thing I made that back when I had the chance. I cooked some items off screen. I think I did at least. I don't even remember. And made that. So now we're gonna want to go onward into this room. Okay. You have reached the door to Master's private room. You, for security purposes, you must confirm your identity. Answer the questions whether true or false. Okay. Video game soundtracks are totally high technical. Hell yeah, they are. Episode 127 of the Gross Chronicles is pretty much the sweetest thing ever. One day, I will own all the Starship x Nut series collectible action figures. Now you must enter the password. Like we're trapped in this room in this jail. Uh, in order for us to, oh, well, hang on, let me um, bring out Dudley here. All 
Alright, good. Now he's gonna use the row again. And with the weight of the block and myself, we can move on. This is room. Room. Oh, I, I almost got the key. I almost got the codes right. Huh. But I guess you have to get it wrong anyway. So let's see. The room on the right is two three two three, and the left is two eight two eight. Oh. All right. So perfect. Now we can advance further. And oh, what's this guy doing here? Hey there. You seem friendly. If so, give me a hand. If not, give me a hand anyway. Sure thing. Why don't you give him my butt? Because now... Freedom! Oh, finally, I'm out. I didn't know what I was going to do. Thank you, thank you. I've been shut up in here forever. You'll never catch me in there again. I must repay you. I'm at your service. I'm sure you can find a use for my talent. Hold on a second. Before we get all friendly, we should see if we're on the same page. You met Francis, right? What do you think of the guy? Your first impression. Greenish, nerdy, awesome! Ah, I see, I see. Is there anything else you write? He's a photo fanatic. He's into butterflies. He's irresistible. Oh, I see. Yes, I see how you would think that. So what do you think about him? He's a monster. He's a techie. He's a stallion. So you think Francis is a awesome, irresistible guy? Basically a stallion? Well, imagine that. You and I feel the same way about him. We got great harmony. Yep, I think we'll work perfectly. Together, nothing can touch us. And we get another pixel. Carrie, the hovering platform pixel, has joined your party. Alright. When you are riding Carrie, you'll move faster and can breeze over spiked floors. With me, you get places in a hurry. Come on, give me a spin. So with Carrie, you also get to move a little bit faster, too. And, and Carrie's ability will also let you jump on spike enemies, which is awesome. Now, let's see. I'm going to go this way here. Um, and flip behind. You'll notice that this... So basically, if you already knew about this, you can just jump behind here and get the codes and then get carried right away. But... I just wanted to show off all the cool stuff that was here because it's really cool. I like, plus, I like this area a lot. I really like this chapter, and I don't want to leave it going to waste. So I will meet you. So now we have to type in those codes, so I'll meet you back over where we gotta go. Alright, there we go. You have reached the door to Master's private room. For security processes, pro purposes, you must confirm your identity. Alright, yep, we did this already. Alright, the passcode, which is... On this room... 2828. Welcome home, Master. Secure amount missed you. Alright, now we can enter the door. Oh, we got a little... Hey, it's Bo and Boodler. And the Punies and Pennington and Yoshi and all the other collectibles. Let's see. Unofficial guidebooks of secret boss-shattering strategies. Give your speedruns a nitro boost with these game-breaking secrets. Uber photography, trains, uber photography, toys, uber photography, pop idols. Oof. Android Love Patrol, Volume 1. Andrew Love Android Love Patrol, Volume 1, Collector's Edition. Android Love Patrol, Volume 1, Collector's Edition, Reissue. Ooh, this guy really is a nerd. This is like... Alright, hang on, wait. Hey, it's a Peach Poster. And in here, we get one of the keys. So you can see all the Yoshis over there. And look at that. Hang on, wait. Hey, Bowser, does this bring you back any memories? 
You like talking to posters? Well, talk to it. Press up. Talk to it. Nope, it just opened the door. Alright, perfect. Well, now that we've done that, there's another door we have to go to and another key to get. So let's go do that. Now we gotta go in the other room. Now, now with Carrie, we can fold across spikes without any harm. Okay. You have reached the door to Master's super secret lair. Ooh! Only Master is allowed inside. You must confirm your identity for security purposes. To confirm your identity, answer true or false to the following statements. Okay. Starship X comics are never to be removed from their plastic sleeves. Absolutely. Role-playing games should be no less than 180 hours long, not counting side quests. Uh, well, considering the time I put in this game, it's kind of a sick bird on this game. Finally, packs are both practical and stylish. Please enter the, the secret passcode. Alright, that is 2323. Alright, Matt. Perfect. Ooh, an elevator. Let's see what we have inside. Hmm. Oh, interesting. Uh, interesting uh, apparel guy here. He has some pictures, some more bow. Po he has some more posters and some, some anime. A, a Petuni poster. He's got the systems over there. He's got some more posters. He's got, a, he's got his Wii here along with some games. He's got some collectibles over here. Uh, oh. That, now this here is a uh, maid. Oh, what's this? Heat log date. 1126. Huh. Almost. Yeah, it's almost. That's almost three days ago. Three days from now. Mood. Ranty. The sun is bright outside, so I'm going to stay in and watch the blubbening. Season 1 has better writing and voice acting than the later seasons. I mean, come on. Everything went totally downhill after the big dream sequence. Still, the animation is used where Tubba Blubba battles robots is sweet. Season 3 was obviously just a vehicle for selling action figures and vehicles. I never understood why they changed the sound effect when the princess appears. It was deep deep it was deep dinga ding ding and then suddenly it went deep dinga dinga deep dinga ling. As if no one would notice. <laughs> True kit. True fans care about important stuff like that. They should totally run the show without commercials that let fans suggest storylines. That's what the fans want, and we're the only ones that matter. I guess I'll still buy the Globening box set. The pre-order bonus is a costume! While I wait for it to come, I'll go online and tell him everyone's stupid. Wow, this game has aged remarkably well. Uh, must buy this month. Access Express train set. This mouse doll with real smooching act action. Survival horror romance sim Larry Koopa, zombie heartbreaker. Magnus Fun grapple figure. Tanuki suit made with real Tanuki fur. Harder than bedrock. The Rockhawk story. Issue D DVD. Issue 47 of Cyborg War. And that radio controlled Professor Franklin and a lot more sweet stuff. Oh, that's, okay, it's the same thing. So yeah, this guy is, uh... I mean, there's being a nerd, which I consider myself one, but then there's just being whatever Francis is. You can see he has a bunch of consoles there. You can see a Nintendo 64, a GameCube, NES, a Super NES, and a Virtual Boy. That's pretty cool. He's got all sorts of games here. He's even got his own gaming computer with multiple screens, much like I do. Oh. Alright, hang on. Did I even... Hang on, wait. So, now that we have the two fort keys, we're gonna want to bring those back to the entrance. And then, um... Open the key to save Tippy. I love... Uh, okay, so. Put the key in. Key obsected. Meow! Key obsected. Meow! Meow! Both keys confirmed. Meow. Wait a minute, moment. You got the. Yeah, you, you look nothing like Master. Only Master Francis and totally hot babes are allowed to enter. All others will get the kitty lasers. Uh oh. Oh no. And the lasers follow you in 3D too. So. Yeah. So I don't. I don't know. Mario's not hot enough, and I don't think Bowser's going to be. But. Guess what? Uh, we do have one hot babe. Man, if you thought Tech was simpy, you guys, I mean, honestly, I mean, if you thought Tech didn't know anything about love, 
Oh boy! Only Master Francis and Totally Hot Babes are allowed to enter. You can enter, after I check to see if you're compatible with Master Francis, that is. Please answer the following whether true or false. Yeah. Video games and hot babes are totally high technical. So wait, if he thinks, wait, so then, so, but wait, if she would think that, then would that make, never mind. If it's limited edition, buy it. Yes. I have bought games I have never played. You know, that, yeah. If it's got fierce giant robot, or giant robot combat, is it insta buy? Yes. They're not dolls, they're action figures with fire punching action, yes. I have dumped a friend over an argument about Starship x not propulsion technology. Hmm, that's a possibility. A sweet cover illustration is way more important than the storyline. Well, to be honest, well. Never pull the top copy from a pile of comics. Find the mint condition one. My first love was an anime character. <laughs> I love that, that's fun. I love going on message boards and complaining about games I've never played. Okay, I have to admit, man, you know, this game is ahead of its time, to say the least. <laughs> wow! Alright, now, if you try to go in there with, uh, after you do that and open the door with Mario or Bowser, you'll get the kitty lasers again, so let's go inside. 